what is going on guys welcome back it's been a while since i've seen y'all yes it's i don't know it's been life's been busy i got injured i had to weigh it out i'm still kind of recovering but today we are finally back out on a boat doing some bass fishing yes i couldn't wait i just had to get back to my therapy which is bass fishing right because i love bass fishing and i know you guys love bass fishing too yeah we're gonna have fun i hope you guys enjoyed all the river stuff that we've been doing we're gonna do it again it's just that the rain has made the river really flooded like really high so it's really hard to wade and fish the pockets i do want to fish for you guys i don't know how long this chesty or this shoulder mount is gonna last on me because it is dog hot like it's heavy it's 85 degrees it's actually 88 degrees um according to my car so, so i had a good friend who tell me that this lake is deep he told me to come out have fun try it out and uh we'll go from there so in other words i've never been here we're gonna figure it out we're gonna do what we know and we're gonna have some fun so stay tuned stick around i'll see you guys already out in the water Woo! it is freaking hot i had to cover up we're gonna do some bass fishing i'll go back and get it first let's fish i got a bandito bug tied on so we good right we're good we'll flip for a little bit it's just my jigging rod, I forgot. Oh, I love fishing like this, man. This is gold. Flipping pads. Oh, yeah. Makes me excited. Oh jeez, I got a little guy. <laughs> hey, no skunk. Yeah, this stuff is tight, dude. Oh, I bite. Oh, oh, you got it. You got it. Oh, I got him. <laughs> Biggins. Okay, I'm laid down so far. Yeah, I got my jig rod out. Started hammering them. I got a fish. <laughs> Little guy. <laughs> Jeez. Got one. That's a nice one, dude. Oh, yeah. Wow. Sheesh, you are skinny with a big head. Holy cow. Whoa, inhale my jig. My goodness. Bro, this bass got my jig all the way down his throat. What? <gasps> no, you're swallowing my jig. Dude, these bass are gone, or bro. There you go. First bass, skinny bass. Sheesh. All right, guys. So I'm gonna fish these docks real quick, just to see how it is. Like I said, I, I don't have too much confidence with these docks yet. Uh, I did catch that one off of the weed line, so I might do that. It's just that it's very shady over here, and it's hot out, so I'm just gonna assume that there's some bass over here especially from the wind direction that is blowing but i could be wrong it might not be a dock lake you know it might just be like a vegetation kind of style lake flip these stuff right here it might be this stuff oh dude i just missed one what she took one of my leg off oh yeah they're in the weeds Oh, are you serious? Again? <laughs> Bro, they're in the weeds. Got him. <laughs> Little guy. Jeez, you guys are feisty. Three times. Look at that. I don't even got two legs on. Oh, okay. I think they're in the weeds then. So what I'm doing here is that you guys probably can't see it through the GoPro on my chest here. I mean on my shoulder, but with my polarized lens, I can see patches of weeds, right? Dark spots if that make any sense. 
that's why like in the video it looked like i'm just flipping at nothing but with your eyes you can see it you can see the the bushes that are out there um that's what i'm targeting right i already got two fish off of it so i'm assuming and i'm guessing that that's what they're ambushing hiding that's one tactic you can do to catch a lot of bass it's it's very obvious stuff you know especially in the summertime when the weeds are higher you can see like the snake or the windows or patches that are out there and then you can catch them that way because bass love hiding in that stuff oh there's a snake what the f <gasps> dad bro ah there's a snake in the water oh shit oh shit it's coming this way get off oh shit <laughs> bro there's a snake in the water dude he's right there look at him he's right there Dude, that's so weird. This thing, this thing, right? Do you guys see that? <laughs> Bro, there's snakes in this lake. I've never seen that before. Ew, that's gross, man. Oh my, oh shit, he bit my lure, bro. <laughs> oh shit, the wind is blowing me too close. Yeah, dip, he's coming this way, dude. <laughs> Oh, it's a beaver dam right there, bro. <laughs> got him. I got one. The little guy. Like the ones at your pond. Big bass, big bass, big bass. Oh my gosh. That's a nice one. That's a nice one. Yep. Oh, yes, dude. Finally. <laughs> dude, I didn't feel him eat it. Oh, my God. What happened to you? Guys, look. Finally, a decent bass. Ripped up jaw and everything. Post spawn. Skinny. This explains why. These fish, they're not even building up mass yet. They're still pretty beat up. So... Yep, sheesh, big head, but thin post spawn body, guys. Look at that. These fish are still on their way to gaining their mass back, but nice fish. Catch and release. Yeah. <laughs> that was a big one. Ouch! Really? That was a big thing, bro. All right, y'all, so here on out, we're gonna go off of this guy, because it's hot. I got one. Hey. Uh, football jig. Not big though, small guy. All right, guys. That's it. <laughs> it was uh, it wasn't bad. We caught fish. We caught a lot of little ones, like a lot. I probably didn't even put all of it in this video, but we caught a lot of fish today. We caught two decent ones, I guess, and that's pretty much it. So it was just nice to be back. It was just nice to see you guys again. It was just nice to be out here and fishing. So with that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys haven't yet, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.